ish barakagan, barakan, slash, pinion, sha with makron blkha with grave n, wade giles, shapolu eh, alternative names, shapalo, full name, il kol shad bagha ish barakagan slash, personal name, slash, a with makron shna with grave she to, a she n a she tu, before 545 87, was the first son of Isak Kagan, grandson of Buman Kagan, and the fifth Kagan of the first Eastern Turkic Kaganate, 581 to 587. The first son of Kilo, grandson of Tumun, fifth Kagan of the Gokturk Empire, he was appointed to the throne by the High Council as the legal resolution to the crisis created by his uncle Tasper Kagan, who had bequeathed the title of Kagan to his nephew Talopian, son of Mukan Kagan. This act violated the traditional system of inheritance from oldest brother to youngest brother and oldest son to youngest. Immediately after his appointment, the legal basis of his power was contested by the erstwhile heir Talopian, Jotun, and Tardu. This highly unstable situation quickly became a smoldering civil war, which the Sui Chinese took advantage of in every way possible to weaken the Gok Turks. Ishibara married Princess Kinjin of northern Zhou and accepted refugees from the Chen dynasty, two moves that were undertaken to legitimize his authority. One of the envoys in his wife's escort was the spy-slash-ambassador Zhang Sun Shen. He managed to become a friend of Ishibara, and spent many years with the Turks. Chang Sun Sheng's knowledge about the customs and institutions of the Gok Turks was of great importance for the Sui Empire. In order to end the civil war Ishbara finally acknowledged the Sui dynasty as his overlords. With the help of the Chinese he defeated his main rival, Tardu in 603, by poisoning the wells which his army needed to cross the desert into China. In the end Ishibara succeeded in saving the Kaganate, albeit at the price of losing his sovereignty. His reign marks the official split between East and West Turkic Kaganates. He bequeathed the title of Kagan to his brother Chuloho. The old Turkish name Sito or Shitu means white dragon. It was a cultural act to give this name to a boy, when a family member has dreamed about this white dragon. <laughs>